Singles action is underway, and in this one, I wouldn't attempt to predict what's going to happen. I'd just be ready for anything. Sometimes that's all you can do. Bad spot for him to be in here, guys. He's got to do something to get back in this thing. Oh, look at this aggression, just oh. pure brutality. Come on, easy. This can't be legal. Totally ruthless, but effective. aggression just oh. pure brutality Come on easy he's not looking like himself here but he's not appearing too worse for wear at least not yet anyway let's not oh. get ahead of ourselves Cole this is just a little bump in the road for him here nothing to worry about well this certainly escalated in a hurry I don't think any of us expected to see him fall behind so quickly he's going for the pin he's a long way from a three count I can tell you that clearly not enough damage done Beautiful technique. That was a tear the features clean off your face. In matches like this, guys, you learn very quickly which superstars have what it takes to truly get extreme. <laughs> He's got the shoulders down. He's a long way from a three count, I can tell you that. Wow. Oh, what a clothesline. Forcefully delivered. Regarding Corey's point about superstars having what it takes to get extreme, I would argue that every superstar in the locker room possesses a mean streak. Yeah, but not all mean streaks are created equal, Michael. I'd say there's only a select few who can turn their mean streaks all the way up to the most extreme level. good here. I'm not sure how much more he has to give. He's really starting to look fatigued oh, here, guys. And when that happens, your whole body starts to give out on you. He's going to need to be careful here. He has to be disappointed in this performance. Ouch. He really is so much better than what he's shown so far tonight. Drop kick! Drop kick right on point. And the DDT! Wow, oh, look at just... Ooh, what impact. There he goes, crashing to the floor. Of course, Extreme Rules matches have resulted in some gruesome moments over the years, and perhaps none was more gruesome than in 2012 when Brock Lesnar busted John Cena open following a vicious attack. Oh, nasty impact. Oh, my God. As Byron mentioned, Lesnar's attack on Cena in 2012 was without question gruesome. And furthermore, I don't think I've ever seen John Cena manhandled like he was on that night. Yeah, Lesnar definitely brought it to Cena that night. But what's truly amazing is that John Cena eventually found a way to win that match. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Showing some quickness there. I gotta say, watching this match, I'm definitely seeing similarities to the May 2016 Extreme Rules match, where Roman Reigns defended his WWE World Heavyweight Championship against AJ Styles. He might have it. This might be it! Oh my! That's what he was looking for, Michael. Outrageous athleticism on the Hurricanrana. When it comes to brutality, I would agree with Michael Cole's assessment that this match... Great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. DDT! This is his opportunity to win this thing. What a slam, Michael. 
He's not going to like this. Across the shoulders. Down, Samoan driver. That's how you put an exclamation point on a match. Ref found a two count. Not yet. Oh, damage to the body. He's close line. I'm not sure I'm there. Victory is on the horizon. And oh, what a kick to the face. God. Can he finish the job? Not a lot of superstars can pull off a move like that. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Both these superstars appear to be operating on fumes here, guys. Incredible. There was a lot of force behind that one. Incredible. There was a lot of force behind that one. Boy, these superstars have been through it all. Can he score the pin? And he got a near fall out of it. I am in shock. What's it going to take to keep this guy down? The end may be near. Oh, what a DDT. Wow. What a comeback. Talk about for the pin and the win. Yes. Three. There's the pin. It's over. It's all over. Here's another quick look at some of the highlights. He ain't messing around. He's getting after it here. Highlight for one superstar, low light for another. And I always enjoy watching him perform. Here is your winner, the boss, M.Q. Knight. There's no doubt about it. That's a big pinfall win right there. That's a big win right there. Anytime you can pin another WWE competitor's shoulders to the mat for the three count, you should be proud. As usual, this Philadelphia crowd is beyond boisterous tonight. Thank you, everybody, for tuning in.
And we're underway. Looking at these Oof. two men, I don't think there's going to be anything traditional about this one-on-one -on -one matchup. These guys are undoubtedly going to give us a show here tonight. Ooh, what impact. Up and face first, Flapjack. Dropped it with a big shoulder tackle. Slammed with authority. Looks like he's starting to sweat now. But he's very aware of who he's in there with and what he has oh. to do to rebound. Hey, you're going to absorb some punishment in a wrestling match. It just, he goes for the cover. He got body on body there, but that's about it. It's way too early. Head scissors applied. Oh, oh, look at this. Here he goes. Is he done? He forces his way free. Man, he just has so much resolve. Look at this. That was nowhere near a three count. Not yet. He's in a little bit of trouble now. Looks to me like he's starting to feel the pressure, guys. Guys, I wasn't anticipating this type of performance for him tonight. He's starting to look a little lost in there right now. When it comes to matches like this, I'd say the more innovative a superstar is when it comes to offense, the better chance they have of victory. Oh, close line! As Byron mentioned, innovation certainly is a key in a match like this. A competitor can't be adverse to taking action outside the ring. By no means is this your traditional contest. No, it's not, Cole, but at the same time, you still win this match the old-fashioned way by pinfall or submission. We've got a cover. Yeah, I don't believe that, that, that he didn't win this match right there. Too soon. Irish whip. Point of the elbow, nailed it. Looking for all the glory here. And he doesn't stay down for long. Definitely has his work cut out for him. He's looking at it. Reverses that one. Is he done? Oh, and he breaks free. But the damage might have already been done, Michael. Hold on! I'll tell you what. Going for it. This might be it. Oh, my. Incredible. Just some great execution right there. Oh boy, he is rolling. He might have it. Oh, nasty impact. That's called making a statement, Cole. This is a treacherous match indeed, as Corey was saying. I can't even tell you how many times we've seen Extreme Rules matches result in broken shoulders on the mat. And only a one count. Oh, wow. Going for the big one. Boom, what impact. That has got to be it. He's going for the pin. Yes! Unreal performance.
Well, they don't call it Extreme Rules for nothing, guys. Let's take another look. Man, oh man, look at that. Almost forgot about this one. Here is your winner. There's a lot of pride on the line between these two athletes tonight. Two of the proudest athletes we have ever seen in WWE. These guys are undoubtedly going to give us a show here tonight. Drop down. Now leapfrog. Now leapfrog. Ball oh, from the rope. If you ask me, guys, matches like this where there are essentially... He's looking at it. Looks like he's starting to lose it here. Nicely done as he gets out of the submission. Color me surprised, Michael. I did not see that one coming. I like the way you describe this match, Byron. It's one giant free-for-all. And while it's exciting to watch, it's absolute torture on these superstars. It is cold. And unfortunately, matches like this usually result in injury. His shoulders are down. He's a long way from a three count, I can tell you that. What a kick out. Grief. Harsh impact. He's on the defensive here. He's really going to need to create some space for himself. Yeah, but it looks to me like he still has plenty of energy in that body of his. I wouldn't look too much into this right now. This match is so evenly contested right now that it's almost impossible to pick a winner. I guess we'll just have to settle in and enjoy the action. Look out! Here's a cover. He's got some fight left in him. Not yet. He looks a bit off his game here. He's going to want to make sure this Ooh. doesn't snowball out of control. Well, he had to expect oh, to take some punishment tonight. You don't step in the ring with this guy and walk away completely unscathed. Vertical suplex. Nice. Without a doubt, this is a volatile situation, guys. WWE superstars are dangerous without weapons. Then you put them in an environment like this, and who knows what you're liable to see. Now, striking blow. Hard to argue Michael's point on volatility and the volatility of this match, but what I think oftentimes gets overlooked is the mental anguish that goes along with competing in a match like this. Oh, boo-hoo, cry me a river, Saxton. These competitors knew exactly what they were getting themselves into when they chose this profession. So much damage inflicted. Looks like he's starting to falter. Guys, this is where we find out what he's made of. You can learn a lot about a guy in a match like this, and what I've learned so far here tonight is that there is absolutely no quit in him. He wants no part of the outside. And ring rattling. He's got him covered. And he doesn't stay down for long. Wow, what a display of heart and determination.
Hooked up. Mitch and Oguchi oh. over. Absolutely planted. Here he What a clothesline! Ouch! Nice. Shut it down. Uh oh. Oh, look at a boot to the face! Incredible. Oh boy, he is rolling. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. He's making a statement here with this attack. Oh! And there it is, boys. Oh, battering ram headbutt. Here he goes for the win! And he closes it out. Three! And you could put this singles match in the books. And here's another glance at these superstars in action. He ain't playing here. He ain't messing around. Yeah, he's putting in the work. No doubt about it, he brought his A game, as you can see here. This should be an incredible matchup. I mean, both men have extensive offensive repertoires, lasting endurance, and an insatiable appetite to be number one. Aside from Saxton's Man. commentary, this has all the makings of an epic match. to stumble here. He's going to need to find a way to fire back. Yeah, he's taking on some offense here, but that's to be expected, especially oh. considering who he's in the ring with. This is all part of the process, guys. He knew he would take on some offense here tonight. He just has to make sure he keeps it to a minimum. They get dangerous out here, especially when there are no countouts. Real quick reminder, guys. There are no disqualifications and no countouts in this one. Anything is legal. Oh, and there are enough weapons under the ring to fill an armory. As Corey mentioned, there's a treasure trove of weapons under the ring. Everything from kendo sticks to steel chairs to fire extinguishers. If you can think about it, it's probably under there. And when that's the case, it's not a matter of if you're going to get hurt. It's a matter of how badly you're going to get hurt. What a stomp. Good grief. He's starting to feel it here. This could be the start of an ugly downward spiral if he's not careful. Yeah, but he's still in considerably better overall shape than his opponent right now. I mean, it seems to me like he still has plenty of fight left in him. Oh, right to the jaw. Oh, oh, you can pick up your teeth in section 112. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. 
Oh, he turns it around. Look at this. This might be it. Oh, my. As we've seen in the past, Extreme Rules matches create a type of hysteria that's difficult to describe, even more difficult to contain. What a strike. This could be all she wrote. He's looking a little weary here. I'd have to agree with what Byron's saying. When you've got action taking place all over the arena, whoa, he, he works his way out. A bit of a Houdini job right there. Harsh impact. Caught with the elbow. Right on the jaw. When it comes to matches like this, I'd say the more innovative a superstar is when it comes to offense, the better chance they have of victory. This could end it in a hurry. He looks to be losing a bit of leverage here. And he escapes the submission. And good thing, that could have been disastrous. Big slam. Looking for the win. DDT! Just when you thought he had nothing left. Oh, what impact. Ike, his shoulders are down. Two! Digging deep for a kick out. I don't think his opponent was expecting that. footing on a move like that. Come on, toughen up. Big time slam. Vicious. It might be cliche, but it's true here. It ain't over till it's over. A minor miracle might be needed to overcome this beating. The wind up. You gotta believe this one's over. What a stomp. Good grief. At what point do those thoughts creep in of, what do I have to do to put this match to rest? I don't know. I don't know as a WWE superstar if you ever have those thoughts of self-doubt. Wicked body shot. Oh, no. We know what this is. Beautiful technique. But can he follow up here? This match is over. How about another look at some of the highlights? Man, this was great. Look at him go. Check him out here. 
He really put on a great show. Here is your winner, Stephen Hume. Wow, that tap came quick and often. Impressive doesn't even begin to describe his performance here tonight, Michael. That win was a thing of beauty. As usual, this Philadelphia crowd is beyond boisterous tonight. Thank you, everybody, for tuning in.